Hello everyone and welcome back into my kitchen. Today I'll be sharing a delicious but simple recipe and I'd love it if you join me. Let's do it. Alright guys, so today I am going to make my mom's favorite ice cream ever. Rum raisin ice cream. And this is such a simple recipe, you're not going to believe it. No churning, no ice cream maker needed and it's going to be nice and creamy when it's done. What I have in my bowl here is um, four cups of heavy whipping cream. I want to make sure that that's cold so I have that in here. And what I'm going to do is with my, I'm using my immersion blender today, it has an attachment with one of these little whisk things and I am going to keep whipping this until the, this comes really fluffy sort of like, to, like whipped cream and then I'll show you what else we're gonna put in in the rest. Actually, let me show you now. I have two cans of sweetened condensed milk and I have here half of a cup of raisins and I soak them in half of a cup of dark rum. You can use any dark rum but I don't recommend using one that is has spiced or other flavors or additives said this was an inexpensive brand so I bought that most of the time I use Cruzan but that's what I use this time around I have some salt here and we're just gonna put a little pinch just a pinch okay put that in there I have some almond extract and I'm gonna put about a half of a teaspoon I have some cardamom, cardamom extract. If you don't have that, you don't have to put it. About a quarter teaspoon. And some vanilla. I'm gonna put about a teaspoon. So what I'm gonna do is, like I said, fluff this up. I'm gonna add this to my condensed milk and get it combined. And simply, when we're done with that, mix them together. Freezer. That's it. One, two. I'll be right back. All right. So look at our cream. You can see the consistency. All right. So I have everything mixed up here. And this took about three minutes with my mixer. So I mixed up my um, milk and the raisins and stuff that I showed you before. Look at how simple this is, guys. I mean, now when you taste this, you're not going to believe that such a little effort yielded such an amazing outcome. And basically, you just want to fold this together. That's it. Just go and fold it together until you have it completely combined. You don't want to, like, beat it so you're beating out all of the air. But you just keep going like that. I'm turning what's underneath and bring it up top until it's one cohesive mixture and simply pour it in a container that can go into your freezer and I recommend freezing this overnight and tomorrow you will be pleasantly surprised. Let me tell you, when you scoop this, it is creamy. There are no ice crystals or anything forming in there. And that's because we have the alcohol that's preventing the ice crystals from forming. So it's creamy ice cream, just like the one you buy at the store. And you made it, you know what's in it, and you can tailor it to the likes of your family. Okay? So... I'm going to get this in my container and tomorrow we'll come on back and sample it. See you tomorrow. Alright guys, so it is now the next day. I made uh, two or three different containers because I want to share it with people. So this is what I'm going to do my demonstration with for you today. I have my ice cream scoop. 
and I want you to look at how simple it is to scoop this. Look at that. This is just like the ice cream at your grocery store. Look. Look at how simple. Guys, this was so easy. I hope you take the time to try this for your family because I think they're really going to love it. I know it's my mom's favorite and I like it a little too much myself. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you so much for coming back into my kitchen. I sincerely appreciate you. And I hope that you try this before the summer is over. I will see you next time when I promise to make another delicious recipe. Bye.